asked to put down the guns, put them away. He refused to do it. He came out into the backyard loaded with three weapons, a 22 rifle, automatic, semi-automatic rifle, a 30-30 rifle, and a 12-gauge shotgun. When asked to put down the guns, ordered to put down the guns by the officers in the backyard, rather than do that, he began to shoot at him with the 22. He, he fired 17 rounds in that backyard, at least eight of which went through the fence. One hit the officer, uh, but for the grace of God, it was a small caliber gun. It went through the fence. Uh, the officer was not ultimately seriously injured and is recovering from his wounds. Uh, but it wasn't for a lack of effort on his part that he didn't kill all three officers in that backyard. He also took shots at officers trying to come to the assistance of those three officers in the front yard. One of the bullets that went through the fence at the officers in the backyard went through the house at 233 Abbey and struck one of the occupants, one of the residents of the home in the stomach. He fortunately also wasn't injured that badly, but nonetheless, he had shot two people now and shot at two more. During the course of the rest of the incident, he fired a shotgun at least four times. When he's again ordered to drop his gun, he won't do it. Instead of dropping the gun, he turns and points it in the direction of the officers, and they begin to shoot at him. They ultimately fire 11 rounds at him, and finally he drops in the driveway at 233 Abbey. He, he was making no effort to surrender, no effort to drop the gun.